Road workers in Luzino, a village in northeast Poland, were digging up the ground when they discovered an enormous gravesite with the skeletal remains of 450 people who had been buried after being suspected of vampirism. The practice which was common in the region during the 19th century was believed to remove the vampire curse. Archaeologist Maciej Stromski said, We discovered examples of belief in the dead returning from the grave, which could only be stopped by decapitation. It was believed that if a member of the deceased's family died shortly after the funeral, then he or she could be a vampire. Therefore, after burial, the grave was dug up and the deceased's head was cut off, which was then placed in the legs. We also discovered an example of a woman after decapitation. The skull of a child was laid on her bosom. He added that in around 30% of the graves uncovered, researchers had also found bricks placed next to the skeleton's legs, arms and heads. In September last year, the remains of a female vampire pinned to the ground by a sickle across her throat and a padlock toe to prevent her returning from the dead were also found in Poland. Discovered during archaeological work at a 17th-century cemetery in the village of Pien, researchers also found the skeletal remains had a silk cap on its head, indicating she had held a high social status.